somebody else's problem will eventually become your problem. Topic inspired by pansies, cucks, wimps, idiots who say, that's not my problem. What's the big deal? And motherfuckers would just give tacit approval on bullshit. Also inspired by my 17 police calls I made in the last few years. Probably could have been 19 or 21. If I would have reported more crime. The ones that I didn't choose to, I take action on. <clears throat> Remember the dude from The Walking Dead? That uh, wimp now, now that he's a, uh, now that he's a multimillionaire. You know, I really need to think about stuff now. I really need to, you know, now that I'm rich and famous, I need to let shit go. And uh, I remember recently I, I made the last phone call that I made was uh, some piece of shit. <clears throat> Stealing two bicycles. Not not my bicycles. <clears throat> I don't know who the fuck on the bicycles. <laughs> but if you're uh, walking down the street with that speed and intensity walking two bikes and being very careful to look down on the floor so that people cannot recognize you look at your face and uh, I don't know you and I've never seen you and you got that vibe that you're just fucking up to no good you all call the cops <coughs> And the cops, are, and that, that's a description, pretty much what happened. All right, sir, what, what street are you on? I told you what street I'm on. And uh, what street uh, he's heading towards. Well, what's your address? Look, I've called you enough fucking times. That you, <laughs> that you fucking more answer that, but fucking... Uh, Information on file, or whatever the fuck. If pizza can do it, Domino's, Papa John's. I don't think I've ever called Little Caesars. Papa John's. If they could say, oh, thank you for calling again. This one, but this being the same, to the same, to the same address. <coughs> If they could deliver a fucking pizza, why the fuck when it's life and limb? Can we have your address, sir? I hung up and uh, wait minutes later, I see uh, cops up taking action. Yes, uh, and I am a big uh, cop supporter. And a lot of the cops that I know personally, whose homes I've been to, <coughs> off the record, anonymously, and then he withheld. You know, they'll, they'll say how there's a lot of fucking wimps on the force. Don't hide behind the badge or a bunch of motherfuckers or a desk. No, man, what you see, that's not right. You see, you need to go retrain and 
I don't see you out there on patrol. I know, I know, I know. I'm the devil. Yeah, but this guy said that the Walking Dead guy, that white guy that looks Puerto Rican. Yeah, man. Now that I've, uh, I'm gonna go check out the black guy. No, I promise. And now I got uh, family to lose, risk, money, whatever the fuck. And I think of um. This is what I could say. Well, look, man, if I call the cops now, well, then I'm going to lose um, five minutes of life because then uh, I can't order that food. I've got to wait in line now because if I'm busy calling the cops or taking action, well, I'm going to interrupt my day, my, my latte date, my play date, <coughs> my... Uh, my dog shampooing. I think my dog's laughing at that. You don't think we get shampooed? It's a waste of money. Yeah, you know, it's funny when, and I've seen it, man, plenty of times in life and on the, the TV, <coughs> news stories, save my kid, not my daughter, my daughter deserves the best, me, 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 my, 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 help, help, help. But then when tragedy strikes, somebody else walk on by. I think it was New York. Um, Some piece of shit, two pieces of shit were mugging. You see a woman kicking her ass on the, st on the stairs. Cold ass hard stairs. <clears throat> so either concrete or steel. And to slip and fall or to get beat on them. I'm pretty sure it doesn't feel good. I saw this piece of shit um, pass her by just dumb. Um, Just walk by, man, and I would think, I'm thinking, man, I hope that person's mom, grandma, daughter, all get beat, raped, and set on fire for being a piece of shit coward like that. Oh, man, that's not right, man, that's wrong. And you see, that's and only a piece of shit coward would stand up for that. Well, you see, um, um I want to, I also want to be like, I was gonna be part of the group and like you know if I if I kick you down and I say that everyone deserves hugs, including the robber, we wouldn't be in this mess. And then I think of uh, this one bitch that uh, a dear friend of mine and I. Uh, we baptized the Grinch. This bitch, miserable cunt, but had an amazing smile. Amazing. <clears throat> and she would throw it at us like, holy fuck. Uh, 
had seen a, um, women get get their uh, butthole stretched out by uh, two wieners, a butt plug, and a dildo with them. Um, with the <laughs> with the less painful smile, but this bitch um she's gotten so good at it that uh, knows what sort of muscles to uh, contract to make it look genuine. I lost my train of thought because I I'm still impressed by that Grinch smile, a total fuck you smile, total fuck you. <laughs> bitch <laughs> definitely one of the top three reasons why I left out uh, one uh, one career behind but no, I can't, can't deal with that not with that one it's literally a time bomb that you're uh, you're messing with because in my opinion someone who is two-faced has an agenda isn't there uh, they're a liability now you don't know who um, they'll sell your soul your safety to the highest bidder they'll do it and they'll do it they will do it I think I was talking some shit about, um, you know, people always say, no, help me, help me, help, help my son, help my daughter, help my granddaughter, help my mama, help my grandma. <clears throat> but, but they won't, um, when they tell people, hey, you gotta save up for this, you gotta save up for cancer treatment. Like, well, they don't have cancer. Well, one day they will, very likely. Well, they'll stop saying that, man. That's evil. It's stupid. If I live to be 101, what's going to kill me? What's more likely to kill me? AIDS or cancer? Um, a drunk driving or a drunk driver? Plane crash or helicopter crash? I just plan accordingly, man. Because I've seen people I've seen people eat a shit sandwich. I've seen people get served a shit sandwich from life. And um, have no choice other than to eat it. So when we let these little bullies, little assholes, little bitches, little cunts, little drunks, little assholes, little motherfuckers, little poor habits, they, these people become unchained. They believe that they're unlimited in power and control. And, and eventually, you know, they believe that their stick is the ultimate stick. And eventually, you know what happens? They will meet someone with a bigger stick. And if it's a beautiful universe, and if it's a beautiful day in the universe, they'll meet not just one, but two, but three people with bigger sticks. And an even, in an even more beautiful universe, they're far more reckless and careless. And uh, take this piece of shit to school, you know. 
whatever the mom or dad or grandparents or guardians in the future, don't worry, the streets will, life will. I've called corporate more than once on various uh, products and services. And, uh, you know, generally speaking, when I call corporate, usually I will see something like, <clears throat> hey, is that dude or that chick? Is that the, uh, the CEO? Is that the president and the vice president? <laughs> and the vice president, because they say things like, uh, we don't need your business, go elsewhere. Um, um, you know, they try to intimidate me or give me dirty looks, try to size me up. And I, um, Um, I just walk away because, uh, <clears throat> well, uh, it feels like these people uh, feel like it's their own business and they want to take their law into their own hands or some shit. Um, no, just not realizing what would be the effects of that. What is that, Crime Watch? Neighborhood Watch. S see something, say something. There's just uh, a lot of bad people out there. You know, but yeah, look, there's a lot of stupid people out there. And then there's a lot of stupid and bad people out there. Keep them in check. Get after it, motherfuckers. No excuses. Go forward. Trump, 2020.